Now I'm talking about as a hitter, about handling pitches that are down, that are up, that are out, or that are in. And it's talking about our approach to the plate. And this is now, you're dealing with two strikes, or you're, you're down in the count, 0-1, and you gotta, you gotta, can't look for your pitch now. Now you're looking for, you're just looking for a pitch that you can hit hard. Okay, and I tell our hitters that balls that are down, they want to just try to elevate. You don't want to have a ball down and be laid on it and end up grounding the ball right back to the pitcher or down hitting a weak ground ball because you're late. So you got to get the head of the bat out. So if the ball is down, you got to get down there and elevate the ball. Now, a ball that's up, I tell our, our hitters, you have to make sure you concentrate on throwing that top hand. And a lot of hitting coaches, I hear a lot of hitting coaches, they don't talk about the top hand at all. They don't even like to discuss it. They say, oh, you do all your hitting with your bottom hand. But I'm, my feeling is that a ball that's up, you really have to teach your hitters to throw that top hand to get on top. Because the, when a pitcher throws you a high pitch, he's trying to get you to pop the ball up. Or he's trying to get you to swing and miss. And rarely will you swing over a pitch. So you don't know, ever see guys strike out swinging at pitches, then they swing over the pitch. So pitches that are up, that it's a strike that they got to go on, you're going to teach your hitters to throw that top hand to still try to get a line drive out of it instead of a pop-up or a fly ball.